Hey there, air signs. Welcome to Reading Journey. I'm Journey. I'm doing a reading for the sun, moon, rising signs of the air signs. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's see what's going on with the air signs. First, I'd like to acknowledge my mama, my papa, my spiritual parents, creators of all things. All right, so let's take a look here. If you're new, welcome. All right. And if you're new, if you want to follow me on, uh, I put other things up on my other platforms. That link is in the description box below. Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. All right, let's take a look. You know what? Let's get the mood going off in this piece. All right, sweethearts. Just take a nice deep breath. Let's get started. All right, let's see. Thank you to all of you who get readings from me. I do offer free readings, and once those fill up, um, I do offer paid readings as well. Just know that my readings are mainly for spiritual growth. I'm just going to be honest. I do love and all that other stuff, but it's mainly for spiritual growth. So this is for sun, moon, rising, um, air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Let's see. Hmm. 14, 14. Something's changing here, air signs. And you might find yourself a little upset about it. This could be somebody you're dealing with. This could be an air sign that you're also dealing with, okay? Yeah, somebody's in, they're in a mood. You could be in a mood because of this change, this shakeup that's happening. I know we're in some full moon energy right now. Hmm. Somebody could be concerned about someone finding a new friend or connecting with other people. Someone may be getting a little jealous some may, someone may even be interested in you and you're not aware of it. Someone else that may watch it, um, someone's concerned about someone gaining a new friend or you gaining a new friend, friend or lover. Somebody connecting or you may even be partnering up in business with someone else. If someone's a little jealous about it. But they're trying, they may be trying not to let it on. But it's starting to get obvious is what I'm getting. Starting to get a little obvious and a little bit uncomfortable. But I feel you have a job to do. That's for someone. Well, let's keep looking. All right. So the main thing, though, this change definitely happened here. Causing some discomfort. Focus on your needs, though. Focus on your needs and desires is what I'm getting. Hobbies, things that keep you balanced, happy. Um, there's new... Ha now, okay, so because there's new opportunities coming with this. I'm getting some will be happy, some will not. Some of you be, will, some people that watch the video will be happy and some people that watch it will not, okay? But there's definitely some type of opportunity of um, gifts, good, good opportunities. And new friends are coming in. Even someone's getting a new addition to the family, so congratulations. Some of you, this could, new addition could be a new wife, new husband, new baby. 
new daughter, new daughter, daughter-in-law, son, son-in-law. Somebody's jealous though here. There's at least one person, whoever watches, whether it's good or bad, there's one person here and is jealous, I feel it. But if you just keep your good vibes is what I'm getting, just keep good, you know, don't focus on that. Lift it up, you know, to the most high. He, she, it, whatever you believe in. And just keep it going because you got a job to do. You got something that you must do, something you have to do. Okay. So keep your head up is what I'm hearing. I'm also hearing Tupac. Keep your head up. Ooh, child. Maybe that's somebody's favorite song. Somebody really likes Tupac. But keep your head up. Keep focused. Because there's lots of opportunities coming in. Okay. And I also feel like do not tolerate disrespect. Okay. Not even from yourself is what they're telling me as well. Showing, showing me, I should say. All right. What's been going on? Let's just do it. worried about finances I just felt that in my heart chakra I'm here don't worry don't worry let's see all of those popped up reverse let me see no my cards are not reversed okay so it looks like I don't know if somebody was acting really nasty to you or you were nasty in a mood and you were acting nasty. Okay, there could be two people who are acting nasty. It has something to do with money. Someone I feel I wanted to say family has something to do with family. There's two people here that are reversed. Somebody could be going broke here. The other person could just be losing their mind. If it's a woman, she's definitely like, she's off a rocker. It's kind of what I'm getting, not trying to insult people. That's the kind of energy that I'm getting. Like, she's just kind of lost it. Hmm. This person could wear maybe a lot of leopard skin or likes leopard print. It's feminine. But either way, there's a masculine and a feminine here who are out of character here. But this could be, and there's somebody that will watch. This is you. Kind of out of character, just all over the place. Just mad. Or somebody you're dealing with just mad because things are changing. Things are changing. Hmm. I want to figure out, what is that? Let's see what that is about. The two swords here. Oops. Like somebody's stuck they now want peace I feel like somebody was doing something behind your back or somebody you were doing something behind somebody's back however it applies someone was keeping somebody stuck somebody was trying I definitely am picking up for one person somebody want to keep somebody stuck because they're in love I don't know how you can be in love with somebody if you're trying to keep somebody stuck how does that work I mean that that don't sound right um, someone's confused there. Yeah, I feel like somebody wants peace. Because they're stuck. It's like they're kind of back and forth, though. It's weird. It's like even though they are out of character. 
it's like they just want to keep themselves it's like a back and forth i don't know somebody yeah something's confusing here somebody's really not stable right now and this could be something you're dealing with that's unstable that's you you'll know what i'm talking about the energies could be unstable with something that maybe you're trying to do or someone's trying to do hmm i heard something about somebody's a, a trans it could be a trans who is a transvestite? Somebody who is like, and they're unstable. I know that's for like one person. something out air signs I think that you know what air signs I think you got this last time you still got some things changing I'm hearing something in the process there's people watching you or watching to see something you do you got eyes on you you might not even know you got eyes on you There's somebody that stands out, though. I don't know if that's for you or you for them. Somebody stands out. Or somebody could be covering you, protecting you, but you don't know it. Or you have protection, which I know that for sure. But there's somebody that really is standing who cares about you who's watching you you may i don't think you know it though they're watching over you this is a person yeah you don't know this they really find favor with you you'll find out eventually you'll cross paths i think Yeah, so you're closing something. Um, I know we got a Mercury retrograde coming up. I just don't know when. I can feel the energy. I felt it for a week. And I always catch it two weeks before. Sometimes even three, four weeks. So I feel like there's something that you're going to want to go back to. Maybe you're going to go travel home. Maybe you miss people at home. 33 on the clock. Or you're going to take a look at something to make a final close on this. Or you're going back to find something or someone. A place that feels like home. So I see that too. So some of you are going back home. Some of you are going to revisit something, reevaluate or see something. Definitely Mercury retrograde material. Or you're going to... Um, Going back to someone or some place that feels like home. Someone's coming to your mind a lot. Someone is on your mind, especially if you're a male air sign. Female though, feminines, you could have that as well. There's something about, uh, I just got that. Someone's on your mind a lot. Soul. Okay. Let's see. Closure, revisit, soul. You're rewriting something, rewriting a chapter, making a new chapter in your life. There's a lot of houses here. This is a lot. 
three houses. Yeah, something about your past, your soul's past, closing something, getting chills. I definitely feel the angels are present with this. You're doing some DNA changes, some ancestral stuff, some, yeah, lineage, lineage, I don't even know the word, we just made one. Lineage stuff, home. Yeah, I can feel this. Like I can feel somebody sinking back into themselves. Something's coming where you're gonna be able to take a rest. Something you've been really, really busy, air signs. You've been taking on fire energy. Or maybe you have a fire moon. But there's something, you've been very busy. So you're going, something's gonna bring you back to home or I don't know if you're just trying to, this could just be simply something happening in your dream state, but there's change, lots of change here though, that's for sure. And I feel somebody's just like, I just want a place of peace. I just want this to be over with. I just want to go home. So you could also be trying to, um, you just, just be feeling that way. Like, I need peace. I want to go home or something like that. You know, sometimes, I don't know, especially if you're a spiritual person. Um, we often long healers and teachers and things of that nature. We were like, we know that we don't belong here. We know this is not our real home. And you have that craving. And that could be coming up. Here goes another house card. Something about a barrier. Hold on here. Hmm. You may be getting some obstacles, some blocks. Someone may or something may try to block you. Or maybe trying to block you. Okay. Trying to block you. But I feel like you've got energy. Uh, I don't want to say that. I said energy, but I feel like you've got guidance. So guides, angels, energy, something's guiding you. You're going to get, you're getting, not you're going to, you're getting guidance here. In your sleep state. It's been a long road. Yeah, I definitely am here and I'm ready for a vacation. I agree. It's been some tough, we've had some heavy hitters. Yeah, some tough energy. Some tough energy. I see adventure coming up in your future, though. New adventures coming up. Oops. A, vac a vacation as well. Maybe going to a beach. I heard Bahamas. That's like one person. You may be going to the beach though. Or making plans for the beach. Yeah, all of this is going to pay off. Whatever you've been doing, whatever you've been working on, waiting on, it's all going to pay off. It's changing. Regardless. It, this is just your overall energy has changed. It's literally changing. It may not be very comfortable. Right, because change is not always comfortable, but I, I definitely feel like you you are you are able to handle it. I'm even getting ready for it. Like, yeah, whatever. I gotta do what I gotta do. Yeah, I see you definitely. So your future, you got some nerd, you got some adventure coming up. Um some peace coming up nourishment maybe you're going to be going out to dinner or something as well having like a little special dinner for somebody or with someone someone could be planning a special dinner for you or something like that yeah i do see somebody going to the beach or planning to go to the beach for sure so you've got some rest coming up 
Like that's I heard Airbnb. Is somebody going to get an Airbnb? All right. So what should you do now? Today, what's the advice from spirit? partnerships, people you vibe with. Yeah, somebody's definitely going to meet somebody who's gonna, and they're going to fall in love. Somebody's going to meet somebody and you guys have a lot of money. Somebody is. I was trying to find out your advice. They're telling me something else. Definitely do something you love during this time. Do something you, you love for the next week. Find something that you enjoy. Take a rest too, Air Signs. Well, Air Signs, it's definitely clear to me that you guys are depleted. <laughs> right while I was in the middle of your reading, phone just said, poop storage is full so that definitely let me know that you need to do some time you need to have some time to shut down sweetheart shut down because i feel like i want to say you got more energy and more work coming your way um so definitely do that do something get out in nature um go do something outdoors you know something outdoors i think would do you good you know just get out there you know um, but going back to what I was saying as well, um, there is somebody who here, I see a partnership coming in for someone and you guys are going to do very well for yourself for sure. And there's going to be a lots of good chemistry between the two. So that's amazing. If you're already in a connection, I feel like your connection, the energy is going to increase. Okay. You're going to have a newfound love for each other. Something new, something shakes you guys up. and Or you could have already had a shake up, which made the relationship seem like it was something new. Every now and then we need a little shake up, right? For us to realize how important our partners are in our lives. All right, now let me see if I can get some advice now because clearly that wanted to be said. So kudos to whoever that is. All right. I feel like you need to take a break, sweethearts. If you guys are on the phones a lot, on social media, take a break from that, okay? Just take a little break. Even if it's an hour, a few hours, do something different. Read books. Um, some, of, some of you, there's a lot of negativity that's been coming through on the social media or that you've been watching. Um, yeah, so they're asking you to um watch something that's going to bring peace to your soul comfort if you're going to watch something watch something different i don't know watch a cooking show watch somebody travel the world or watch a biography that's something different to switch off um that other negative energy that's coming through yeah take some time just breathe you know do some breath techniques or do some I don't know if you do yoga, do yoga. Definitely, I would recommend getting outdoors for sure. Maybe you can start taking up a new workout routine, regimen for yourself. Work out those lungs, get healthy. Um, you need some fresh air in those lungs for sure as well. I'm seeing that for someone. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to end it here. I hope you found this helpful. Thank you so much. I do appreciate you. Again, I'm Journey. This is Reading Journey. Take care.